you didn't know that teen drivers are four times more likely to get into an accident. What's up? Hey guys, how's it going? It's Jake and welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be talking about Nero and how he may be connected to Mob of the Dead. We're going to be taking a look at a jump scare we see from Mob of the Dead and just show the resemblance of how it may be Nero and we're going to be talking about why it might be Nero, the possibilities of it actually being Nero. The guy that actually brought this up is Resortified. He'll be in the description below. He makes zombies content. He was actually one of my inspirations to start zombie videos back in the Der Reese, or I mean Der Rise days in Black Ops two zombies which was actually pretty cool but if you want to check him out he makes some great zombies content in the description below but anyways let's get into today's video let's show your support by leaving a like let's shoot for 115 likes again and let's get into today's video so taking a look at the jump scare from mob of the <laughs> i'm so sorry if i caused any heart attacks but taking a look at the jump scare from mob of the dead we see this weird looking character uh, face, just his face, and it resembles Nero. This is a picture that Resortified put together side by side of the jump scare and Nero himself. And the similarities are kind of different, you could tell, because this one looks kind of creepy, like looking ugly ass bitch face. If you know how I feel, why would you say that? Weird monster thing, but if you take a look at the facial features, it actually shows the resemblance. You take a look at the wrinkles under the eyes, you could actually see a mustache on the figure in Mob of the Dead as well as the wrinkle, uh, forehead wrinkles. So it has the same facial structure uh, resemblance. Okay, so the similarities are there, they're similar. But why would it be Nero in Mob of the Dead? And are they, did Treyarch plan ahead this far into the future for Mob of the Dead? Did they put Nero's face knowing that Shadows of Evil would exist? Well, it's a possibility, and I'm going to explain why it would be Nero. We know that Nero sold his soul to the devil because of the Mark of the Beast that we see on the hand from the trailers of Shadows of Evil. And because he sold the Mark of the Beast, what did it mean when he sold his soul to the devil? It means that he wanted more power. He wanted to be this known person that is mysterious but is uh, more powerful than a normal human being. He sold his soul for fame and fortune, for being the best magician out there. It says that we see from these posters, Nero knows all. He will predict your future. So we get the idea that he sold his soul to the devil as well as this picture where the devil is actually on his shoulder whispering into his ear. And that kind of uh, symbolizes that he has sold his soul to the devil. As well as it would make sense that he uh, is in Mob of the Dead because we get the idea that Mob of the Dead is, er, controlled, the zombies are controlled uh, by the devil. And there's nothing that is disproving that, but there's nothing 100% proving that. But it is a plausible theory and idea. We know Nero plays a bigger part. I mean, we know that there's characters in the zombies mode where one character is more significantly more important than the other. And it's a, he has a major role, a bigger role than the other characters. And we see that with Shadows of Evil. We see that there is Shadow Man in the background of the poster, then we see Nero bigger than everybody else, like he is standing over the three other characters. So that could be another thing symbolizing that Nero is a little bit more important in this little storyline for Shadows of Evil, but that's just my little theory. But anyways, let me know what you guys think about this in the comments section below. Also, sh share your support, share this video around, leave a like, and if you haven't seen my content before, I recommend you subscribe for more Call of Duty Zombies content, and thank you for Resortified for making this possible, this video, just bringing up this idea, because it is a good find. Anyways, I'll talk to you guys next time, goodbye.